Good morning everybody, Down and Entrepreneur coming to you from Cairns, North Queensland, Australia again. It is Friday, we have made it to the end of another week, uh, fantastic weekend tomorrow for some of us. Uh, we're still working, we're still hustling here though, uh, but it is what it is. If you have a weekend coming up, I hope you have an absolute blast. Um, so what I want to talk to you guys about today is uh, probably two things. Um, and I'll go into sort of each one. And the first one is um, uh, a little phone app that I talked about. And I think it was maybe like one of my first videos that I did. Uh, so I just wanted to touch base on that um, and really, really show you guys like the potential of this app and what you can do with it. Um, so if you're looking to make like a little bit of extra money on the side, and look, this is a great week for it. Um, so it's a great week to show it. Um, not every week's going to be like this. Some weeks, you know, you, there might only be like a couple little jobs there or something like that. Um, but it, basically what it is, it's a mystery shopper app. Okay, so you're like an undercover mystery shopper. You're not really representing supermarkets or, or, or big sort of retail outlets. You're actually representing more the companies that supply them with goods, so to speak. Um, so I just want to I just want to show you guys quickly. I'll grab my phone and I'll put it up. So I don't know if you guys can see that, um, but I have three supermarket audits and I have 13 pharmacy audits. Now, the big thing with that is if I click on them, each of the supermarket audits pay $5.50 each. I'm pretty certain that's US. Um, so $5.50 US is probably you know, just over 20 bucks Australian times three. Uh, and the pharmacy audits, they're like 10 bucks each. That's $130 US. That's like $160 Australian. So just by going out, and the beauty of it is, is where the pharmacies are, they're pretty much in the exact same locations, you know, like the, or the shopping centers and whatnot, where all the supermarkets are. So I can go, I can do the supermarket audits, and then I can go and do the pharmacy audits, and I'm probably going to knock out like an easy 200 bucks a day for maybe two hours of my time, right? It's like a hundred bucks an hour or like just an extra two hundred dollars in the bank for the week like how good is that like guys definitely check this out fieldagent.net i think it is um i'll leave um you know, a link in the description um now the other thing that i want to talk about um and i i, I sort of mention it from time to time in some of my other videos but i follow a lot of uh, very successful people and one of the people that i follow is a, a guy called uh, gary v or gary vaynerchuk um you know if you're in the, the sort of the whole online scene then you've probably heard of the guy um you know he's got a lot of great content um here on youtube um you know his podcast instagram facebook uh, you know the the guy's story is like incredible. Um, he'll 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 literally take a kitten and turn it into a lion. Um, but I was watching one of his more recent speeches um, from slightly earlier this year, yesterday, and really opened my perspective. So if you are in the online worlds, um, and you're say advertising something like Facebook or Instagram, um, he mentions something, and this is about your targeting and your marketing, guys. Um, instead of say wasting money on clicks for say targeting 18 to 65 how about you target say 35 40 to 65 and above and the reason being it makes perfect sense i mean i know what i'm like when i get on facebook i'm a busy person um so you know if i i get on facebook i'm just like that's that's how i scroll through my facebook feed so i don't really have time to absorb what's being put in front of me um, you know, let alone click on some ad, it has to be very, very appealing and um, like catchy ad for me to sort of click on it. Um, whereas, you know, your 40 to 65 year old, the pace is a bit slower because in, uh, you know Instagram, Facebook, all that sort of stuff is still fairly new to the to the slightly older generation. So their scrolling time is more. So they have more time to engage and actually absorb what they're viewing. So if you're looking for better conversions with your products and your, your marketing, then maybe have a think about that. Uh, maybe think about targeting um, you know, a slightly older demographic. Um, and you never know, you'll, you might be surprised. You might really increase those ROIs. Um, but apart from that, guys, that is about all I have uh, today. 
you know, thanks for all the uh, the love that we're getting on the uh, the top five myths of Australia. Um, the view counts are still going through the roof on that one. Um, so yeah, guys, keep coming over, checking it out. Um, like I said, um, you know, like, subscribe, hit the bell notification. We're trying to do daily uploads about money, money mindset, and motivation, uh, and the odd. Uh, clip about um, Australia here uh, you know if you do want to see more videos about Australia um, or, or a particular topic then please leave in a, uh, you know a comment in the comment section and um, we'll try and get to it uh, so thanks very much guys I uh, hope you're all having an amazing week thus far uh, if you're about to get under the weekend have a great one and uh, have an awesome day cheers